Hey guys, it's your boy King Your Place here. Today I'm bringing you Ho Ho EX. So at first glance, Ho Ho EX doesn't look so good because for three energies, it's 130 and, th and snipes 30 on the bench. So if you have a fire energy, you heal 50 from it. To speed them Ho Ho EX up, we we're using Vivalon. Vivalon, energy color once in your turn. Before you attack, you may flip a coin of heads. So you're for basic energy card and attach to one of your Pokemon. So whatever energy card we need, we can just attach it to Ho Ho EX. The next card we're running is Smeargle here. So if we have energy that, if we double up on the energy and one of the energy that we actually need is discarded, we can just throw him in there, and then we can start attacking. Muscle Band here for 150 because you need the extra damage. And if you 150 EX, 30 Snipe the other bench EX. I sanded out the other EX Pokemon on the bench, so you get four prizes like that. Energy switch just in case Vivalon is like starting off and we attach energies to it and we don't really want them. There again, float stone just in case they lie center out Smeargle or any Scatterbugs, Pupa, or Vivalon. Two max looks are just to speed up, so two super rods to get cards back in the deck. Four birches, four sycamores. Our stadium of choice is four to giant plants. Each player's grass Pokemon can evolve during his or her first turn. So we don't have to wear red candy. That's why we run a 3-3-3 line. Two level balls to get out. Smeargle, Scatterbug, or Spewba. Three Ultra Balls, Ho-Ho, Vivalon. Four VS Seekers, of course, to get our supporters out. And then three of each energy. And let's get into a match. I am recording every day, guys. So Almost got the Geddes. Full Art. Just 11 more wins. And we're facing off against Wazor. I do get to go first this game. And we have an okay start. Not the best though. I usually don't like starting off with the fire energy. We're playing a deck that oh not we're playing knockdown. So we can't play item cards and then there's lots of damage. And we did draw scatterbug, so that's the turn. I'm gonna go ahead and get another scatterbug and play. Then I'll put a fire energy on there. I'm just gonna discard these two and get uh, another sh one, two. So we do have all of our lines of scatter bugs and stuff, so we are gonna throw the, the third one on there. We can use our VS Eager. Let's get this sycamore. We do get a pupa for next turn, and we're just gonna pass. We have a lightning energy for next turn attached to the whole hole. Pretty good start. And my opponent just has a little oddish here. The good thing about this deck is that. After you get set up, you really don't need any items, and that's what the, this deck revolves around. The Hoot Hoot and the Noctowl, easily. Oh god, he might actually get the turn one no item cards for both of us. Kind of helped me out there too, so yeah, he doesn't get it, but he just helped me out a lot. Uh -huh. I do get all that one and that one. I'm thinking I will kind of want. Yeah, I'm gonna stick more here. I am getting rid of three birches and my other Lysander, but I do get the Vivalon. I wanted to attach that one, but and then energy color. We do get it. We can attach a light. What? We need a water and a grass. So I'll attach the grass energy. I 
I'm gonna play the VS Secret now because if he does get the lockdown, I am gonna need a supporter. And I'll bench another whole Ho Holy X, and I guess I'll pass my turn. Just take out my Discord file. Bench is another Otis. He has three cards in his hand. You usually want to have a lot, a lot of cards in your hand, but he's just not getting it, I guess. And he just got to pass his turn. So I will give the water dude to my ho ho, and now he's gonna start attacking. I do flip heads. I do get another, and he's just gonna quit the game. I have, I got it too fast to start for him to even do anything. Let's go again here. Not going first this time, so let's see how the deck does now. Ooh, another good, great start this turn. Start off with the hole. I'm not gonna bench the scattered bug just yet, just in case. I'm playing Ladio CX and he wants to last in but it is a Reggie steal. Turret coin. Oh, he's trying to use iron. <laughs> he's trying to use iron head. To get we guess one hit knockout. He's gonna use that golden trainer meal right here to get the evil soda. Oh, we have a bronze. Well, he doesn't have a bronze one to play. Now he will. Oh no, a dribbler. So execute that deck. And just gonna pass the turn. We're going to bench this pupa. Play the max elixir and get a lightning energy. Forest evolve into the Spupa Sycamore. Are right, I gonna be able to attach the grass energy and the muscle band? And pass our turn. My opponent does actually knock me out with this iron head Reggie steel. <laughs> Seems he's gonna Evo Soda for the exit drill. Get attacked twice. Heavy ball. So probably looking for No, he's not gonna grab anything. He's gonna birch. I think he's look probably looking for the bronzor. The bronzong, but he forgot that he didn't get a bronzor with the level ball. He actually got a drill bar. He's gonna test the DC hitting me for seventy. And he discards energy because I'm a Pokemon EX. I will use the Vivalon. I'll get a water energy. I guess I'll super out here. I'm basically trying to get the lightning energy attachment. I mean the grass energy attachment and energy switch. Do not get it. I could get it actually. And I guess I'll go for it. Why not? Just discard this and this. And I'm going for the knockout here. So if I do get, if I am able to flip heads here, I will be able to knock out. And I do be able to. And I am going to flip heads, attach the lightning onto the whole EX. And he's powered up in one turn. I'll bench the other one. I am gonna elemental feather for the knockout and do 30 to the bench. And my opponent's just gonna quit. Let's get into one more match here. So from zero energies to three energies that quick. Facing Kai Rain. I ran. There, guys. I am going first this game. And 
and another good start for me. I've been getting pretty good starts the past three games, I guess, we put, that I've showed you guys. He starts off with a sand dial. What I'm going to do is I'm going to discard this and this guy's. Two flip tails and I'm gonna pass here. I'm probably gonna Pokemon Flame Club, so I'm not gonna be able to knock him out. I get two in case. Hopefully next turn I'll be able to knock out this sand dial with the energy attachment and with the Vivalon. I'm just going to ram me for 20 damage. So I'm going to attach the lightning energy. Use the Avalon's attack. I do flip tails here. I'm gonna ultra ball these two cards. Get a spupa. Flip heads, Vivalon. Flip heads? I do flip heads on this one. I do the last grass energy I got in the deck. And I'll just do 150 and 30 to the same K. It's taking his time trying to figure out who should he bring out. Tap the dark energy, so he's just gonna use confusion wave. Fantastic grass energy here. I'll see if I can actually pull off an attack with this one. Get the water. Another turn. As soon as they bend him, guys, he's ready to attack. I can just switch out to him. And 130, 30. I do get another pride card. I'm just going to bring the one that has damage on it. He's gonna give up. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to smash that like button, and I'll see you guys next time. Lego.